guys, happy pumpkin season. Guess what time it is? It's pumpkin spice latte time. And today I have a video that shows you how to make this guy. It's so creamy and delicious, you're gonna wanna keep watching. So for this latte, we're gonna start out with about two cups of coffee, our pumpkin, you can use heavy cream or butter, pumpkin spice, a swerve, and MCT oil. And then to mix it all together, you can use a frother majiggy device like this one here. You can certainly use a blender too, but the frother just vibrates and gets all that milk and stuff all frothy and creamy. So right now I'm going to show you how to use the frother method. In a bowl you're going to add your coffee, your pumpkin, your heavy cream, and MCT oil. And I'm just going to give it a good froth right now just to get it all just kind of blended and, and started to get a little bit of creamy before I add the, the spices and the sweetener. So then I'm going to add the sweetener and the pumpkin pie spice and a little bit of vanilla too, I forgot to tell you that goes in. And again, just froth it until it starts to get a little bit um, creamy and foamy on top. And then that's it, we pour it into our cup. I love to top mine with some sugar-free whipped cream that I make and of course a little sprinkling of pumpkin pie spice. And you're done. So my favorite method is actually to use a blender. I feel like it's a lot easier. It um, gets it a little bit more foamy and, and creamy tasting. And this method I'm actually using butter instead of the heavy cream too. And um, just to show you that there's different fats that you can use. But we're just gonna pour that into a cup and you can see how just like foamy and frothy it is on top. So much better than using that little battery operated frother I got from Amazon. Well, what'd you think? Pretty easy, huh? And now you don't have to waste five bucks every time you go to Starbucks or Dutch Brothers, which I don't even know if they have a keto pumpkin spice latte, but um, yeah, just stick with this one instead. It's so easy to make. You can make it early in the morning, right before you head off to work, throw it in the blender. So simple, guys. Well, guess what? I've got tons of other pumpkin recipes coming out this month, so stay tuned if you're a big pumpkin fan like I am. I've got pumpkin bread, pumpkin muffins, pumpkin pancakes, pumpkin cookies, anything pumpkin you can think of, I'm coming out with. So make sure you subscribe to my channel this month so you don't miss any of these awesome recipes coming out. Enjoy.